In this video, I'm going to be testing out the Manfrotto Fig Rig and seeing how well it stabilizes movement. So first of all, uh, at the moment I am shooting with the Tokina 11-16mm lens and the Canon 550D and we're going to do a walkthrough with just me holding the camera and seeing its shakiness and then one with me having the camera attached to this. So what we'll do is we'll get a dog and we'll chase a dog. Rosie, come. Rosie, come here. Come on. Come on, Rosie. Right, we're going to chase you around the garden. Go, 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 go. Yeah, we're going. Where are we going? Oh, stay there. Oh, hold on. Okay, let's go. Let's go, Rosie. Come on. Rosie, let's go for a walkies. Okay. Okay, Rosie, what are you going to do? You're going to jump up. Rosie, you going to jump up this? Go on, Rosie. Jump up. Jump up. Hop. Hop, hop, hop. Come on, Rosie. There he goes. Oh, where are you going to go? And up. Up. No, no, that's it. Okay, right, Rosie, let's go into the garden. Into the garden. Into the garden, yeah. Okay, go, go. Go. Duh. Yeah, happiness. Happiness. We're chasing the doggies. Yeah, okay, that's Rosie. And that's Bob. Uh, Rosie, go get Bob. Come on, let's go get Bob. Let's go get Bob. Go. Yeah. Oh, and there's Bob. There's Bob. Hello, Bob. Hello. Oh, oh. Okay, well done, well done. Right, let's head back to the house now and let's do it with a fig rig. Okay, so this is what the fig rig looks like once you've got it attached with your camera. And as you can see, it's the Nikon, uh, the Canon 550D and the Tokina 11-16mm lens. And okay, so now, because I'm holding it out here, a lot of the vibration is greatly reduced. I hope. So now we're gonna go chase Rosie again. Okay, Rosie. Rosie, come on, let's go play outside. Come on, come on, Rosie, go, 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 go. Yeah. Wee. Okay, Rosie, let's see if we can get you to jump up onto your onto your thing over here. Come on, come on, Rosie, come on. Hop, hop, hop. You can hold no onto, onto the box, onto onto the house. Come on, Rosie. Come on, come on, come on. So you can hold the fig rig with one hand as well, which is quite good. Uh, okay, right, let's go into the garden. Let's go. Go, Rosie, really go. Go. See, she knows the she knows the game now. Come on. Oh, wee. Yeah. Right, where's Bob? Where's Bob? Bob. Bob. There he is. There's Bob. There's Bob. There's Bob. Come on, Bob. Come on, Bob. Oh, Rosie. Really? Oh, what's that? Okay, let's go back. Come on. Come on, Bob. What's that, Bob? Oh, Bob. Is that an interesting something that smells nice? Ooh, come on, Bob. Come on, Rosie. Come on. Bob, come on. Come on, Bob. Come on. There you go. Uh, okay. Rosie, there you are. There is Rosie. Okay, Rosie, we're going to go upstairs again. <laughs> it's called a fig rig. It's to help kind of stabilize footage. I'm testing it out. All right, Rosie. All right, Rosie. Ready? Let's see the world from doggy eye view. Where are we going, Bob? Ah, oh, Bob. Good boy. And as you can hold the fig rig from above, you can have it quite low down. Go, Bob. Go to your bye-byes. Go to your bye-byes. Bye-byes. Good boy, Bob. Hello. You can also hold the fig rig from the bottom of it, so you can actually hold it right above your head. Get a nice high view of things. And then bring it back down. To there. With the wide angle lens you lose a lot of the shakiness anyway, but I think this is definitely given a good good example of what you can do. Like holding it up there. See up around the house. And then down from bird's eye view to doggy's eye view. We can hold it right down. Hello. 
door. And into the bed with Bob. Goodbye, Bob. Hello, Rosie. Hello. Are you showing off for the camera, really? Yes. Okay, let's go see the world from Rosie's eye view. Come on, Rosie, let's go somewhere. Let's go. Come on, Rosie, come on. Where does Rosie go? Where does Rosie go? Rosie comes to see Kim. Go see Kim. Rosie, where's Kim? Rosie, where's Kim? There's Kim. All right, woof. Okay, now here's the idea of me being able to hold it with one hand. I can hold it, and we can go from down here, up, and then going right over the balcony. Or not balcony, the kind of bit here. And then I could even hold it up like that. So maybe in future videos I'll be doing a video like this. I don't know. Does that look weird? Maybe it does look weird with the fisheye. But uh, yeah, I think it's quite cool. I think it's, it definitely does get rid of a bit of stabilisation. And the fact that you can hold it from above or below is good. And uh, the fact you can hold it higher or lower is good. Um, but £250 worth? Good. Uh, I don't think so. I think you could definitely make one of these yourself for a much cheaper price. Okay, so from now on, I'm going to do videos where I'm holding the camera like this. Or I could even do it one hand like this and that should kind of be quite good it'll be quite good also like doing a running shot like if I'm going duh, 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 duh. Rosie come drop 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 Rosie drop okay ready fish it Come on, Rosie, let's go play! Yeah! Come on, come on, Bob. come on, come on! Rosie! Rosie, drop! Rosie! Rosie, drop! Rosie, drop! 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 Ah. Ready? Fetch it! Go on! Hey, come on! 